What's going on? So today we're going to be working on how to land a hook in boxing. You always get taught how to throw a hook, but when it comes to actually sparring with somebody um, or even trying to land it on the bag, it's very difficult to do. So I'm going to break down a couple different techniques that you can do to get that hook down so you can land it in sparring and you can land it on the bag. So just check the rest of this video out. All right, so in boxing, we get taught how to throw that hook. I'm gonna go over a couple techniques how to throw that hook right now. So when we, when we're, I'm gonna do this from a orthodox stance today. So when we're, when we're boxing, we, we throw that one, we throw that two, we get our hips loaded up, okay? Our hips loaded up now, so now we can pull that two back and we can land that three. But it's very hard to land that three if you're really trying to hit somebody. I'll explain here. I've got Blaine right here in front of me. Let's say I try to land a one-two combo on him. So I'm right here. One, two, three. I can't really land it. It's very hard. Now, I'm going to try to land it again. One, two, three. You see, I have to lean here. We don't want to lean. It throws you off balance. It opens up a lot of things that you don't want. So, um, get off balance, fall. Um, it's, it's just terrible. So, what I really want you to focus on when you throw these is you can open that hook up just a little bit more or you can step with it at the same time. Example, so me and Blaine sparring here. I'm gonna land that one, two. Now before, I did this, and I would have to lean or something, but now I'm gonna add a step with my front foot and with the hook, so it's gonna be a step hook. So one, two, three. So now I can step into that punch. I have it, risk myself being off balance. My hands are still on my face, and I've got to go for them, and I still turn my hips when I landed that. The reason I'm throwing a two when I'm setting this up is because it torques my hips a little bit. You don't have to throw the two. You can actually come here, one, load up, boom, land a three, all right? It's just a nice power hook. I'm gonna show you in those two examples again. So one, two, three, one, two, three, all right? And then a one, three, one, three. So that's how you add the step with the hook. On this next part of the video, I'm gonna show you how to actually land the hook without having to step with it. All right, so on this part, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to open that hook up a little bit more, okay? When you open the hook up, you don't want to throw a haymaker and risk your shoulder being damaged and all out of place and stuff like that. You don't want to come here, okay? You don't want to do that. That's, that's just an injury waiting to happen. So what you want to do, you want to still keep a good form. You want to keep your shoulders up still. You want to keep your hands up. You just want to open it up just a little bit more. So watch this. One, two, three, okay? So I've still got good tension in my shoulder. All right, I'm still controlling my arm. I'm not letting it just hang out and be loose. All right, so watch this. One, two, three. All right, I still got a good hook going here. This is just a long range hook. All right, again, one, two, three, three. All right, still have that bend in my elbow. All you have to do is just open it up just a little bit more. It doesn't have to be a perfect 90 degree angle. All right, so again, I'm gonna come here. I'm just gonna mess around a little bit. That time, I added a little bit of a step and a long range hook at the same time. All right, now this time, I'm just gonna throw a long range hook. Now I'm gonna throw a step hook. All right, now I'm gonna add them both together. All right, as you can see, the hook can be landed from all sorts of areas. So uh, I hope this helps you Learn how to throw the hook a little bit better. Just try to work these techniques and then just get a little bit better at it. I'll see y'all in the next video.